Today, Kevin and I are going to be trying Hen of the Woods Kettle Cooked Potato Chips. I have the sea salted, uh, buttermilk and chive, and red wine vinegar. These were only a dollar each at Kroger because they're only two ounce bags. Uh, but I think a dollar is a really good price for these. That. Uh, that's not much to pay at all. They were they're on cool. a they're special cool. display. Um, and they're these, actually in the back where the deli is. Yes, these are made in Cincinnati, Ohio. And so if you're watching this video and you've never heard of these before, it's because I think uh, these are just now making it here. Yeah, um, we're, we're not that far away from Cincinnati. You're right, yeah, we're not far away at all. And uh, Alicia had actually mailed us a bag of these called A Touch of Smoke. They're so really if good. you do um, a search on my channel, Tammy Dunn, Hen of the Woods, then that video will come up where we reviewed A Touch of Smoke. But uh, yeah, these are right in Cincinnati and we had never heard of them. So when we saw that display in Kroger, it was like, ah! There they are no, because really. I was shocked to see them. So it says our journey began in 2013 with a simple stand at Washington Park, an urban farmer's market in the heart of Cincinnati, Ohio. With a passion for real food and extraordinary flavors, we assembled a team of like-minded chefs to bring obsessively crafted products from our kitchen to your home. We hope you enjoy them and enjoy them often. <laughs> um, this says not all salt is created equal. We took a high five from the ocean to add just the right zip to our already thick cut cooked until crispy kettle chips. With a clean and bright finish to our sea salted chip is your go-to for all your favorite dips, picnics, and lunch boxes. Um, PenoftheWoods.com. It's uh, one ounce, about uh, 28 grams, about 18 chips, 140 calories. Are yours the same, 140 calories, or are they? Yeah, one more. And these are uh, gluten-free. Yeah, they're all gluten-free. So no these, GMO. they look like regular chips. What does yours say? Hashtag. Hashtag uh, see, ceased the day. <laughs> <laughs> they're all different. Except seized the day. Do crunch them without being hard. That's good. Mm -hmm. A little bit of salt there. They're salted without being overly salty. Mm -hmm. I wish there was a touch more salt, honestly, but not a lot more. Well, once I, I, I've got the first one, and it was just a regular salsa, but then I got another one, and, and I could taste it even more. Mm -hmm. uh, this is one of those where... Yeah, you know, it says two servings are in the container, but I would eat the entire bag. Oh yeah, because yeah, it's only 140 calories. That's only going to be 280 calories for the whole thing. Yeah, yeah I would um, eat go back too. I think that's good. That would go good with the sandwich. It yes, this is a good regular potato chip. Yeah. So now we have buttermilk and chive. Uh, imagine fresh herbs from fresh from the garden chives and herbs, perfectly blended with rich, creamy buttermilk. And these look a little different. Not much, but I mean, you can tell there's something on them. Look how big this one is. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I won't shove that in my mouth on camera. <laughs> well, it's a pure on green onion. I love that. Mm -hmm. If you like that green onion flavor. Which I, which I do, yeah. Um, that's just like, I mean, that is green onion. Mm -hmm. Those are good. I love that. It almost seems uh, it gives it a freshness that a yes. regular onion chip doesn't have. Yes. This one has a fresh flavor. That is delicious. For me, I wish it has a little bit more salt. Yeah. But I really love that green onion flavor. Yeah, and I don't really get the. Is it buttermilk? Buttermilk. I don't I, really get that creamy, creamy. Now, see, I do. I yeah. get. Yeah, I get the onion, and I do get a creamy. There is a creaminess in these that the other ones did not have. Maybe if I, if it was missing, I would say, ooh. This is, I would notice it was gone if they didn't have it in there. Right. And these are red wine vinegar. I love a good vinegar chip. Salt and vin chips of the past. 
may have turned your happy face to a big pinch, but our chefs added the perfect amount of red wine vinegar to this insatiably crispy kettle chip that gives a well-balanced flavor, not just a filling. Uh, what started out as a garnish to a salad turned us into a snack food company. The red wine vinegar chip has captured hearts and taste buds all over our hometown, the Queen City. Hmm. So this is like one of the first ones, most popular. Mm, it smells Yeah, good. sometimes they put, you get a vinegar chip and they're so strong it almost hurts your mouth. Nope, that's good. It's a good amount of vinegar. When I, it's good. when I put that in my mouth, what immediately came to my mind was deviled eggs. Yeah, because you add vinegar to it. Because I add vinegar. Uh, um, Not that it tastes eggy. <laughs> no, no. But it just, it tastes like, um, you know, when I do a taste test of the, the vinegar and the mustard and the, right. the um, mayonnaise, it just reminded me immediately of that vinegar. Mm. That's a good flavor. I like mm -hmm. that because it's not overpoweringly strong. You can still get a little bit of the chip flavor too. Mm -hmm. That's, That's nice. My That's favorite, probably my favorite one. Now see, my favorite is the buttermilk. I like child. the vinegar. I like that the, would definitely be my second. I like the vinegar a lot. I think it's delicious. Um, Alicia had told us when she sent the, the touch of smoke, she said, the red wine vinegar are my favorite. So I agree with that. I think they're good too. Yeah, they're very, very good. But for me, I just love that onion flavor. Yeah, the green onion really does mm -hmm. make a difference. It's nice. If they just put just a little bit more salt, uh, it would take it up another notch. But I just love those. So And if, the plain ones are good. They're just plain yeah, chips. Yeah, they're just plain potato chips. So if you see these, uh, give them a try, especially yeah, really if you good. can get them for a dollar a bag. I don't think that's bad to be able to try a new chip. And the touch of smoke was the one that we tried in the other video. If I was to add those into this, those are my number one. Really? See, I thought yes. they were just smoky. I See, that love would be like, them. That'd be like my third. I love them. I'm, <laughs> uh, I ate the majority of that bag yeah. by myself. Yes, They're good. Those would, the touch of smoke would be my absolute favorite um, of the four. And then uh, it, the buttermilk and chive yeah. and then the red wine. Um, and they did have the touch of smoke on this display. Uh, if I didn't say that it. before, we had just already tried it. Um, I, if I had thought about it, I should have bought one just for me to just enjoy to yeah. though, because they are so good. So if you like that smoky flavor, they have those. Uh, so I will have a picture for you at the end. Uh, they're just regular chips, but I'll take a picture anyway. And thanks for watching.